Welcome to my channel. I'm Jiang Jingxu. Let's work on the problem eight in chapter four. In this one, it's still the application about Newton's second law, but it's a little bit difficult. You can see, um, first thing, the quantity given is about the baseball's initial velocity displacement, final velocity, and mass. So ask you to find the average force applied by the ball on the glove. So in this one, if we want to find the force, the glove on the ball, we must find the mass and acceleration on the glove, right? But there is no such information on the glove. So we need to consider Newton's third law. Newton's third law tells us the force, the ball act on the glove, equals the force, the glove act on the ball in magnitude, but opposite in directions. So there, we can find this force Magnetic force comes from the baseball. You can see the mass of the baseball is given. The next step, we need to find the acceleration. See, look at the acceleration. We know initial velocity, final velocity, and displacement. So acceleration is very easy to find with our favorite equation. And input acceleration inside the Newton's second law, we can get the net force. See, this one, in first step, we need to find acceleration on this uh, baseball. And then we must keep a negative side there. And the negative side tells us the direction for this change of acceleration. And then input is acceleration in Newton's second law, we get the force about the ball on the force on the about the baseball on the glove. 